You could have knocked me over by blowing on me today when I got on the scale and saw I was 218 pounds. I can't remember the last time I weighed 218 pounds. It had to be sometime in 2002 after basic military training at Lackland Air Force Base. I'm not going to bore you with week-by-week uh, -week body part measurements, but let's put a few things in perspective. Here I am in my before picture. This is my disgusting pig monster picture. Uh, in this picture, I weigh 283 and a half pounds, and I'm somewhere around 29% body fat. Here I am 16 weeks later, 218 pounds, I'm at 14% body fat. Here's a picture of me on July 7th, 2007, and this is a pair of jeans that I hadn't been able to wear since sometime in late 2006. Here I am in those same pair of jeans. Uh, let's go back to that other picture for a minute. If you notice the muffin top uh, Dunlap disease problem I got going on. and Now uh, here I am. It's obvious I couldn't wear these jeans without a belt. Here's a picture of me at my basic military training graduation there at Lackland Air Force Base. And I weigh about 212 pounds in that picture. And in all honesty, that's the last time that that service dress uniform really fit me. Here's a picture of me at the end of my sixth week um, trying to squeeze into that pair of service dress pants. If you'll notice the whitey tidies because I could sort of jury-rig the belt enough to keep those pants up, but I couldn't get the zipper all the way up. And uh, for the past few years, whenever we've had a service dress inspection, I've been doing that and then hanging the jacket over to hide the fact that I couldn't get the zipper up. And here I am today, again at the end of my 16th week, in that same pair of uh, service dress pants. So here I am. October 20th, 2007, 16 weeks. My body weight's gone from 283.5 pounds to 218 pounds, a loss of 65 pounds, and my body fat percentage has been sliced in half from 29% to 14%. So for me, the life change challenge is over, but it's really only over on paper. Tomorrow I'm going to wake up, first thing in the morning, apple, protein shake, hit the gym, cardio, chest, shoulders, back, try to work my abs. Not bad for a fat guy. Another protein shake afterwards, have three to four healthy meals for the rest of the day. So if I can maintain my weight for those next 12 weeks, further reduce my body fat, I'm thinking that early 2008 I'm going to create a regimen that's more geared towards muscle building and incorporate power exercises rather than just the maintenance, waste-reducing exercises I've been doing for the past 16 weeks. My body's changed so rapidly in the last 16 weeks that I don't even think my mind has started to comprehend the physical changes uh, that I've gone through. I think any time anyone ever accomplishes anything, they always are quick to quip, well, I wouldn't have changed a thing. Personally, I would have changed a few things about what I've done over the past 16 weeks. You can read about in my body blog at bodyspace.com slash savage muscles. I really don't have anything else to talk about today. I have a feeling I'm going to be reflecting a lot until my after pictures show up, and I'll have another blog up then. Thank you.